Assalamu alaikum. Dear students, hope you are fine by the grace of the Almighty. So today I am here from Labi and Jaffi State and today our students are class 3 English version and our subject is elementary science and today we are going to chapter 5 soil. So today I, students I am going to show you the exercises of chapter 5 soil. So let's start. So dear students, at first we have some filling the blanks. So here, number one, soil is classified into three types, clay soil, sandy soil, and loamy soil. Then number two, the soil which has the largest particles is called sandy soil. Number three, the soil which consists of sand, clay, and humus is called loamy soil. So students, these are the filling the blanks. Now we will go to tick mark or MCQs. So here, number one, in which type of soil can jackfruit and legumes grow well? A. Sandy soil, B. Loamy soil, C. Clay soil, D. Salty soil. So students, we know the answer will be C. Clay soil. Number two, in which type of soil can watermelon and groundnut grow well? A. Salty soil, B. Sandy soil, C. Clay soil, D. Loamy soil. So students, we know the answer will be B. Sandy soil. So students, these are the MCQs. Now we'll go through the matching. So students, here is the matching. So at first clay soil, humus, in sandy soil, watermelon, loamy soil, jackfruit, decayed remains of plants and animals, paddy. This. So, students, this is the matching. Now, we'll go through the answer of this matching. So, here, number one, clay soil, jackfruit. Number two, sandy soil, watermelon. Number three, loamy soil, paddy. Then, number four, decayed remains of plants and animals, humus. So, students, these are the matchings, filling the blanks and F MCQs. Now, we'll go through another exercise. So students, now we are in question answers that were given in the book and here is the answer I made by myself. So here the number one question is, why do crops grow well in loamy soil? Answer, crops grow well in loamy soil. It is basically a mixture of sand, clay and humus. It has a tight hold on water. Water drains well in this soil. Also. Humus is very fertile for growth of corn. Because of these reasons, crops grow well in loamy soil. Then number two, what are the characteristics of sandy soil? Answer, characteristics of sandy soil are given below. A, color is pale brown or light gray. B, size of particles is the largest. C, it is dry. D, it feels gritty. E. Water drains fast through. F. Watermelon, cucumber, etc. grow in sandy soil. So, students, this is the second question. Now, we'll go through the third question. The students, here is the third question. Mention two differences between loamy soil and clay soil. So, the answer will be two differences between loamy soil and clay soil are given below. Loamy soil. Number one, it is made of sand, clay, and humus. The clay soil, number one, it is made of clay. Then loamy soil, number two, its particles are of various size. Then clay soil, number two, its particles is of the smallest size. So students, these are the question answers that are given in the book. Now we'll go through our next lesson. So students, we are now in extra question. These extra questions are made by myself and, myself and also the answers are given here. So students, let's go through the question answers. So number one, what is soil? Answer, the loose material covering on earth's surface is called soil. It consists of rocks, particles of sand, silt and clay. Number two, what are the types of soil? Answer, there are three types of soil. They are A. Clay soil. B. Sandy soil. C. Loamy soil. Number three. What is humus? Answer. Decayed remains of plants of an animals are called humus. 
Number four, write down four names of plants which grow in sandy soil. Answer, four plants which grow in sandy soil are A. Watermelon, B. Groundnut, C. Cucumber, D. Muskmelon. Number five, write down four names of plants which grow in loamy soil. Answer, four plants which grow in loamy soil are A. Paddy, B. Jute, C. Maize, D. Weight. So students, these are the extra questions I have made for this chapter and these are all the exercises of this chapter. So there students, that's all for today. Hope you have liked the video. If you like the video, then don't comment to like and also don't forget to share. And for new videos, must subscribe our channel. So that's all for today. Assalamu alaikum.